My name is Peter Fisher. I'm a director at Bennett's Associates. As we know, climate change is an existential threat to all life on this planet. And there is a huge amount that the built environment can do to improve its impact on the planet. I grew up around fields and animals. I was very aware of the precariousness of nature. Bennett's Associates was founded more than 30 years ago by Ram and Denise Bennett's, and they had been very interested in sustainability before it was even called sustainability. You know, at Landsec, sustainability is the lens through which we make all our decisions. It has to be front and centre. And it's personal as well. My kids are five and six years old. In 10 years, they're going to say to our generation, how did you help? Well, we're in the midst of a climate emergency and real estate is responsible for up to 40% of the carbon emissions, so we have to be part of the solution. Landsec is extremely passionate about sustainability. We were the first real estate company in the world to set science-based targets in 2016. Timber Square is a landmark development in the heart of London's South Bank. It's an incredibly vibrant destination and we want to create a space which can bring the community together. I'm the project lead for Timber Square. We've worked together with Landsat before. We've always tried to push the boundaries of what was feasible with sustainability at the time, but this project is really taking that to another level now. We want Timber Square to be the sustainable ecosystem where global corporates sit alongside local startups, all brought together by their desire to make a difference. The goal of this project is to be one of the first very large scale net zero carbon buildings in the UK. And we're achieving that by more than halving the operational carbon emissions, the embodied carbon emissions, and the transport associated with the construction. The brief we set to the team was to come up with a design that would respond to our sustainability ambition. We've asked the team to find a way to keep as much as the existing building standing. The reason for that was to keep the materials that are already in the building and prevent the use of any further resources. We then asked the team to consider low carbon construction materials, such as engineered timber. Timber is one of the most exciting and promising construction material we have today. So a slab of timber is effectively made out of carbon that would otherwise be in the atmosphere. The existing East Building at 25 Lavington Street was built in the 1950s. Its previous use as a commercial print works means that it's got a very robust structure with good floor to ceiling heights. Therefore, we've been able to retain the existing structure and build on top of it with a lightweight extension, um, which has enabled us to save a huge amount of embodied carbon in the base structure and the foundations. At Timber Square, we really adopted a human-centric approach, designing the buildings from the inside out so they could really work to enhance the health and well-being of our customers. That has been achieved through much more access to open space, so virtually every floor has a roof terrace, more access to greenery, and also the materials internally, which are much more natural than is usual in buildings of this nature. We're in a really privileged position. In the real estate industry, we can help shape our cities, and that's a huge responsibility and motivation to do the right thing. I do think that building for the future doesn't necessarily involve massive sacrifice. It isn't about us having less. Rather, we are just building a better future. The climate challenge is an amazing opportunity for the real estate industry to be that force for good and really make a positive change. Our customers are setting ambitious targets and we want to partner with them to help them achieve those goals on schemes like Timber Square. Tackling climate change can be a very daunting thought, but there are pockets of hope and I like to think that Timber Square is one of those. The blueprints for a better future.